What's up guys, Lockout Man here in the truck early this morning. I'm here to talk to you very quick. You know, I'm waiting for uh, my 10 hour to be up. It'll be up in about an hour. Uh, I already went, took my shower and everything, but I decided to come on because I seen this post in Facebook that I that I think you guys might be a little bit interested in especially for the new drivers that's coming into this industry because this is the main situation that you're going to run into all the time all the time you're going to run into situations like this where companies is going to make an offer to you like this and you're going to come on facebook into these facebook groups and there's a lot of them and you're going to ask this simple question is this is the right move for me now the question that was being asked was the question that was being asked by uh polo from the facebook group right he writes i just got my cdls cdls and i know a lot of you guys have a problem with the s at the end of cdls well I, I just want to say, get off your high horse, man. I mean, it's only, it's only, it's only speak. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know, it's CDL, CDLs, whatever. I mean, come on. It's, it's, you know, some people, some people say with, say it with the S. Some people say it without the S. I, I don't get the, I, I don't get the whole blow up about CDLs. But anyway. Anyway, I just got my CDL a Friday. Today, I was offered a job with a company that told me that they will pay me $50 a day for two days of in-class training, and then they will pay me $75 a day for my truck training. And once I'm done, they will pay me 33 cents a mile. Uh, plus this C pick is this a good offer for me to come into the industry well look I I'm about to tell you my my situation back in the day uh, just like you bruh I I was I was a new jack I was a youngin I was uh, I, I was a greenhorn and I didn't know that there was other companies out there that will offer you uh, better than what this company is offering you now from what I'm looking at I am thinking that this could be US Express I'm not I'm not sure don't get me wrong with that but it could be US Express because it's almost what I was offered and what I took now what I took and why I took it is different from why you may take it you see what i'm saying now there's this 20 there's a two thousand dollar sign on bonus but i think us express is offering fifteen thousand. so this probably might not be us express but at the time i came on this is about the same gist that they gave me as far as as far as coming on with their company uh Gross annual income thirty-five thousand to sixty-five thousand, two thousand dollar sign-on bonus for full-time drivers at the ninety days. Not sure how that is paid out. Up to fifteen hundred dollars of training conversation. Entry level is thirty-one. Uh, twelve dollar stop pay, twelve dollar detention pay for two hours. Sixty dollars layover after 24 hours, and that is 24 hours from the time that you get there. Uh, Three dollars for DOT pre-trip inspection. I'm not sure what that is. Well, y'all already see what that is. Twenty-five dollar gift card for DOT inspection with no violations. So that means if you go through the scales and you get a you know you get a clear you know you get a clear bill of health you get a $25 gift certificate tuition reimbursement eligibility after 90 days that was offered to me because I paid my school in out of my pocket and I don't think it was after 90 days for me I think it was right after I started so the first 
paycheck I got was $150. And that's how they paid it out. My tuition was like five, was like a little bit over 5,000. And I thought when I came into the industry, you know, when they say reimbursement, I thought it was gonna be paid right then and there. Like I was like, oh, cool then. I get my five grand on my on my second first to second check. No, no, that is one hundred and fifty dollars paid over. I mean, paid every month over the course of at that time it was like three years, something like that, to get paid back five thousand dollars. Crazy, right? I know, I know, it, it's crazy. I know. Let's see, healthcare eligibility after ninety days. Uh, six months safe driving bonus after a year that sucks right there because I figure if you do safe driving and you're offered a bonus for it it shouldn't start after a year you you work there see US Express started me with my safety bonus right when I started but then I had that little incident up in up at the pilot and that pretty much wiped it all out. So I had to go an entire year without the bonus. It was like an extra five cent on top of the CPM that I got. This after a year driving, but then it's six months after a year. So you got to go a year and six months before they even start paying you an eligibility bonus. One week vacation eligibility after a full year. 401k plan after a full year now the 401k plan now i wasn't hip to that and i never started it now that i talked to some drivers and some people that's in the 401k i wish i would have started it four years ago but you best believe i got it going on with my new company uh one year base increase to 33 cent and two year base increase to 35 cent so guys, you know, leave your thoughts in the comments below. This ain't a long video. This is just a, a quick Q&A right quick. The young man wanted to know if this is right for him. Now, what, what's right for me may not be right for you. Now, back then, this is what I was offered, and this is what I took. Now, what I, why I took it wasn't the fact that it wasn't about the money. It wasn't about the money. It was about me getting out there, getting my experience. That's what I really want. Because at that time, a lot of people kept saying, oh, well, lockout men, after you get your year in, you could go anywhere you want to go. The money will flow in. The money this and the money that. And I took that with some videos that I made because that's what people had taught me. But as I grew with the industry, I knew that wasn't the case. Now, getting your first year in is good, it's cool, but what you wanna do, and to be honest with you, what you really wanna do is get at least two, if not three, with the same company, all right? With the same company. Now, I wonder why I'm saying with the same company is because now companies are jumping on the bandwagon of looking at your history they, they want to look at your history how long you've been working how many jobs that you have in the first year now if you the type of guy that job jump job jump job jump from year i mean from job to job to job then yeah that might be a little bit of a problem for you <laughs> okay I'm just saying because a lot of companies now, back then they didn't care. You know, they you you could leave one trucking job and get with another trucking job. You can leave that trucking job and get with another trucking job. But now they are looking at it because it's like they looking at it because you probably might be jumping from job to job just to get the sign on bonus. But let me tell you something about that. The sign on bonus ain't all that gravy either because you don't get that sign on bonus <laughs> when you come on like it's supposed to be when you sign on that's when you get the bonus but it is paid out <laughs> over a year over months over time your situation may not may not be uh for everybody so you just gotta 
take your time do your research and see what works for you now there are better companies out there that uh that will give you a little bit more cp cp c damn it man you know what i'm trying to say you know what i'm trying to say anyway uh with that said look if you have any questions or something like that you know holler at us you know we're out here you can you can leave your comment in the description below and i am happy to help you out you know what i'm saying if you like videos like this and more man don't forget to subscribe don't forget to like don't forget to comment and hit your boy up with some coffee it is early early in the morning and i'm out without my coffee all right i need that i need that the coffee link is in the description and in the comments below all right this is lockout man in the morning whatever opinions that you guys could give this young man leave it in the comments below man because you know sometimes the facebook group you know them them guys in the facebook group when they come in to ask a serious question you know they they just try to make fun of it you know what i'm saying so hopefully uh this will help you out my dude um if you have any questions, definitely hit me up in the Gmail, lockoutmen at gmail.com, or go over to my Instagram at lockoutmen and, and holler at me. That's all you got to do. Holler at your boy. I'll talk to you guys later. Y'all have a beautiful, blessed day. Peace.